Okay, so um, hi, we're back, <laughs> and um, I have the nails painted a lime green, and I'm going over with um, the best glue ever, and I'm just doing the sides, the corners, and I'm going to um, do all of them like this, and um, let them dry, and then I'll meet you back. Okay, now uh, with Peacock Dazzle, this is all dried up, and I am going in, and I am pushing in the, the foil in, and I'm just kind of getting it in there, like that, okay, and when it's done it'll look like this, okay. Okay, now with your striping brush I'm going to go in with um, a bright pink and white mixed together and go over the top. I've used a top coat really quick on top of the blue uh, foil so that it would crack and do its thing and then just go straight over the top with the next design. So, like that. And like this. And that. Okay. So I'm going to let that dry. Okay, now with um, my, I, I went in with the pure fluorescent pink and touched the ends down like this. And see how it brings that pink out and pops it and turns it really fluorescent? That's what I'm going to do with all of them, like this. See just the ends. And it's so translucent that you, that you can kind of go out of the lines here and it doesn't even show. So we're going to go through like that and then, okay, here we go. And now I'm going to go in with a tiny bit of white and I'm going to touch my little palette so that I get most of my paint off. And then I'm going to touch the tip and go from the tip downward. See, so it's going to turn bright pink to white. See how it does that? And we are going to just do each one like this. Okay, and when I'm finished, it's going to look kind of like that. And do you see how they like, turn into like these sweeping little like tendril flower? No, what is that? Tendril animal print? And they're really, really bright. So bright. Can't wait to look at these in the light. So, one more. And just touch, touch, and pull. I'm using such a tiny amount of paint. I don't want any more than that. See, I'm just kind of just sweeping it along, lightening up all of the tip parts. Oop. And I'll add a paint, so go like this. And like that. And it just gives you a different uh, take on uh, foil and topping. Um, and now, let me show you. When you top coat this the second time, it should pop all of the bright colors. So I am going to do this and see how it blends and pops all of the colors at once. See, I'm, I'm going around, taking my top coat off. And if I have any like, like uh, over top coat, then I take that off too as well. But I, I need to seal all of this area. So I'm sealing, sealing, and then like this. Not, don't brush it on or you're going to pull all of your design off and you're going to pull all of your paint, off, I mean all of your foil off. It's just going to mess everything up. You just want to get right in and pull and seal, pull and seal, pull and seal, and seal. And then take your finger, take it off, and then if you see that you need more of it, uh, uh, another coat, then you go over with the second coat, but see how the see how that seals it so pretty. Okay. Okay, we're back, <laughs> and I'm with Lady Lime. This is my Lady Lime, and she always gets lime nails of some sort. And we are finished. And these are the tiger prints over the foil on lime green, and they are really super bright. And I'm going to show you them in the light. <laughs> and that was a rhyme. <laughs> <laughs> I have to go to the bathroom. <laughs> okay, so here is the light like this. And do you see how they're like really super bright? That is so, so pretty. Okay, let me scoot down so you guys can see better. I'm going to try to have a really good picture of this for my blog because they are really bright. And um, I'm going to be back in just a second. 
Haha, uh -huh. I can't tell if this is showing up good on the light. Dang it. I want these to be really super bright in here. But we'll see what they look like on camera. And I might put them in and I might not. But they are really, really cool. So 